Welcome back everybody to another All Things Nerd video. As always, my name is Nathan and we're going to continue talking about Scream 6 tonight guys. We are almost to Scream 6. We're almost there. Yesterday we were two weeks away. Now we're not two weeks away. <laughs> we're closer. So we're almost there to Scream 6. The movie's going to be dropping on March 10th coming up. I already got my tickets. I hope you guys got your tickets. I'm very excited for the movie. Cannot wait to go watch it. Uh, it's going to be very fun to see Ghostface back on the big screen. Uh, since we had Scream 5 last year, now we're getting Scream 6. So I'm excited. But if you guys are big fans of the movie, something cool. You can actually go visit a real life ghost face, a real life ghost face shrine. Okay, hear me out. If you haven't heard of this, there's a new thing called the Scream 6 The Experience. If you guys are familiar with the show The Office, they kind of have kind of a similar thing called The Office Experience. Well, this is a Scream Experience. So what this is, is this is a new experience, which will be a free 15 to 20 minute immersive walk through the city that never sleeps, where you can get up close and personal with the new and legendary props from the horror icon franchise. Maybe you'll even get a call from Ghostface. This event will take place in Santa Monica, California, California at 1231 Third Street Promenade. Hope I'm saying that right. <laughs> I'll put the uh, address on the screen. The best part is this experience will be free of charge. Reservations have already filled up, but don't worry, there will be a standby line for walk-ins. It says, while it's a bit strange that this exhibit is not New York itself, this is another fun way to get horror fans' anticipation levels for Scream even higher. Also, from the sounds of it, this will most likely mirror the ghost face shrine seen in the Scream 6 trailers. This new ghost face has evidence from all the previous killings. They have things like Tatum's bloody sweater from the original Scream. Miss Loomis' suit from Scream 2 and the bloody knife that Sam Melissa Brera used to kill Richie in Scream 2022. This new version of the famous killer even has all the previous ghost face robes from past films. They're a horror collector's worst nightmare. <laughs> so if you guys haven't seen this yet, go check it out online. It's called the Scream 6 The Experience. I would love to go, but I don't live close enough to Santa Monica. And um, I would love to go make the drive, but I don't think my wife's going to be down to do that. <laughs> but it would be fun to go. But if you guys do get to go, let me know and share your experience um, on the channel here. Uh, I would love to see video or some film of the, of the place, uh, photos of it. It'd be really cool. Man, I would love to go check out all the props and stuff that were actually in the Scream movies. So it'd be fun to go see this. But it's basically like a museum, like a history museum of Scream. So it's like a real life ghost face shrine. Uh, they said it's a 15 to 20 minute immersive walk. Uh, so that's pretty cool. So you'll get hands on and up close with all the props and all the things that were used in the film screw the scream movies and uh so yeah that's pretty cool but if you guys haven't heard of this go check it out it's called the scream six the experience um the tickets are free so if you're in california and you're a big scream fan and you live near santa monica this is the place to go again i'll put the address in the uh description below of where you can go to access this but um yeah i'll also put a link on where to go uh for your reservations and all that good stuff so as always guys my name is nathan i'm excited for scream sick just as much as you guys please like the video if you haven't yet subscribe to the channel as always i'll see you on the next one take care